and the princess. Good day, everyone. It's Peachy, and we just got our next partner. And unfortunately, this is our last partner. Boobery's ability is a primer. Press X to make Mario throw Boobery. He will then walk a few steps and explode. Wow, he works like a bomb, -bomb like Bombay. Use Boobery's explosives to blast cracks open, destroy walls, and activate switches. You, you can even throw him onto ledges above you. In battle, he can detonate on ground bay and bound. Or if you like, you can use his bomb squad type bombs that explode one turn later. So cool, we got our next partner. Okay. Now what you need to do is go back because everyone is very concerned about Admiral Brewery and his last request. <laughs> I know, that was so weird. I don't know why it didn't stick out to me that Boobery was going to be our 6th partner, well technically 7th now. But yeah, um, I remember when I first played this chapter I thought he was, you know, like going into his fallen paradise as he referred it to as. Yikes, yikes, no, 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 you stay away, you get away from me Fuzzy, I don't need no more battles with you. Ding, ding, yeah, yeah, chase me all you want but you're not going to get me. Hey, where did you come from? I, the Boobery, welcome back to you. Do you know how to worry we were? My stuff has been so sad, Ben. I must worry about everyone here, but who wears flabby of no one? Do you know how hard it is for me to sit here and save and worry so much? I do not know what is out there waiting to lurk in a pants like me. We do not even know how to get home for the sake of blue briny sea. But no more yelling, now is the time to pull together work as a team. Flabby old boy, I must say, you talk rather too much. Such insolence, girl! I growl at you like angry jungle beasts. So in any case, Mario, about that crystal star you spoke of earlier. There was a rather odd rock in the far east of the jungle with a skull covered into it. I call it an old sea bomb's intuition, but that skull rock smells suspicious. Hey, Boobery, you wanna know what really smells suspicious? Love you, Zarbit. Ooh, it smells like low tide. <laughs> You may be onto something with that skull rock, I will say. Well, then anyone can figure that out, you mean, you mutiny. Hmm. Joker, I mean, how obvious. I was already saying in my head the treasure's behind that rock. And as I continue to protect the noble duty of this camp from invasion, I, Captain Mario, carry on. I'm sorry to make so many requests, but you know. Flavio, you old crash crapper, if you want treasure, why don't you go get it yourself? Ah, well, yes, uh, Admiral, you see, I, uh... <sighs> yes, you have a point. Let's just decide this fairness scared, Shetty. Listen to everyone. Who thinks I should go along to investigate School Rock? Oh, heck yes. Yeah, take him, please. Have fun out there, jerk. Off with you. There you have it, Flavio. Barely squared, eh, what? What, what? Uh, I'm not bare. Flavio hit you all. Flavio will join you for a short time. Oh, so Flavio is going to be our partner? I didn't know that. Hey, what's this guy say? Hey, uh, that Skull Rock you mentioned sounds interesting. Let me know what you find. Yeah, why does he want to know what we find? He's obviously that guy who made that weird laugh. Boom. <laughs> Yahoo! So if I'm timing this right, that means that today is actually the 1st of August. So I've still got one entire month. I had a feeling Paper Mario would run from the beginning of July to near the end of August. I won. <laughs> I'm hoping it goes until the end of August, but who knows, it may be longer than that.
Oh yeah, here's um, Merle's. Remember that fortune telling? Which I did not go and visit her so you can tell where she's at. Ooh, Mario, you're lucky. I just hate it when you're lucky at Mario Party. That's all. Boom. Check out Flavio. He's following us. I don't think they had anything like that in the original Paper Mario. You can only have one partner at a time. Oh wow, Yoshi. Good job for carrying both of us with you. I like how he just stands there. He's like, okay, uh, I wasn't programmed to sit down, so you don't have to do the city for me, Mario. Poor Yoshi, all that weight he has on his shell. I mean his shell, on his backseat. Ah, oh, there it is. I knew there was one here somewhere. <gasps> ah, now what is all this? A dead end taunting Flappy or is a dead end Ness? But, hmm, um, is this? I think this is the school for Rod Blueberry Babbler about. Well, this is probably a reek of ancient secrets, yeah, as long as the punch of puzzle. A large stone blocks the way. It seems to be carved into the shape of a skull. There's a space in one of the hours where you could conceivably place something. Uh, Mario, you don't suppose Flavio's gem might go in that space in the eye, do you? I don't know, Vivian. Let's find out. Skull Captain Cass's Gate, Red Shines, Boom Boom Festival, Stash Brothers, Three Red, Three Red on his head, Blue Stash Belly four times, Boom Boom, the fireworks go. I'm just thinking about the way. It's not like Flavio's scared or anything, but you know, it's something I've never been able to know the song's meaning. What is that you have to me? You want Flavio to lend you something? Now what could I possibly have that you would need, says your anxiousness. What? You want me to lend you the skull gem? You really need some, huh? This is a heirloom of the house of Flavio, you know. But I suppose it's alright, because I am Flavio. He has such ludicrous wealth. I'm just lending it, though. Don't they run off with it. Don't make me dot pay. Don't worry, Flavio. We're just gonna be right here. I wish I was rich. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. Yeah, so that's the basic idea of the song. The boom, ba boom, ba boom, ba festival. Even though that's not a very catchy song, if you ask me. And there's curiously a bomb on the top of there. <gasps> boom. Oh, such excitement! The cave entrance! Oh, uh, what? Uh, my skull jam! M Mario, what were you thinking? That jam was part of the House of Flavio! Whew, it's in one piece, so we won't get dark pay. Whew. Oh, what a happy day! I have a skull jam bag! My jolliness is no in! Now then, I'm sure you're all disappointed, but Flavio must be heading back now. I cannot let those back at the camp worry about me further. You two understand, yes? So, let me know when you find the Skiller Stone, or daddy. <laughs> oh, Flavio. You just love money, don't you? Uh, Month Star, Day Circle Music, Brave Explorers. They actually find the treasure I tremble with anticipation. We better save. Or else we're in trouble. Pirate's Grotto. Oh! Ooh. Uh oh. Ghost. Ghost. Toast. Ghost. So there's really pirates in this mysterious place, is there? Wow, wow, wow! Well, at least we're now starting to make our way to the treasure. <laughs> Did you hear? 
because the enemy grew in size, it also meant that its fainting had to be redone too. It's a now this one you want to be very careful, or else you can miss this, ah, or fall in there like I did. Now, funny thing is, this chapter does match. Um, what do you call it? Um, Mount Lava Lava. I always thought it did, and well, the reason behind that is because you remember in Mount Lava Lava, you actually went through a series of um, volcanoes and stuff. Well, you see, this one you actually go through a series of water. But since I love blue and water more, I prefer playing this chapter over the Mount Lava Lava. There go my coins down the drain. Bah! That almost stopped me. I will not be stopped! Time to do this! My skills are superior! That was a very close call, Vivian. So we haven't seen um, Bullet Bell Blaster since the last Paper Mario. So it's kind of cool that we're, they make the return in this game. That's a bill blaster, it's a cannon that shoots bullet bills. Max HP is 5, defense is 2, it doesn't attack directly but it shoots bullet bills. Yeah, that's all they do. They just shoot bullet bills. Why? I don't know. And then when they shoot bullet bills, they don't attack. They're just like, oh, I'll just lay back here and wait to attack. I keep falling in the water. Well, I guess that's a good thing, technically. Do -do 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 -do. Check out that waterfall. You know, it's kind of funny because I always thought it had eyes and the mouth. It might see it or it might not, but I always find that hilarious. Haven't we seen this pink babam before? Indeed. Let's get rid of it first. Yahoo! Come on, Mario. I know you can do better than that. Probably because it's the end of the recording and I can't get any time to time. I don't know why it does that near the end of the episode for the week. See if I can do it. Nope. We have to explore this pyre cave. I wonder how much treasure we're gonna find in this game. Ho oh, oh, ho oh, oh. ho! Ooh, para goom para buzzies right there. Coops! There we go. Over here, buddy.
Oh man. You know sometimes when we have the flowers in the audience, I don't really like the amazing daisies. It's just because that they can put them to sleep and well my star power takes even longer to refill than usual. You can't carry that. You can't carry that. You can't carry that. Turn back, turn back, go no further. Ooh, so we must be going towards a dangerous area if they're telling us to turn back. Who's haunting us? Ah, Mario, you suck. I can't wait to have a bigger audience variety. It's gonna be awesome! Get your kicks at Route 66! Oh wow! I like how the, all the items just stayed in one area. Ah, key! Well, we're gonna need that key in order to access other areas. Now that, they've got, now that we've got the key, we can progress the story. Turn back! Turn back! How many strength sprites do I have? Six! Wow! So we have enough to upgrade Boobery as well. I actually like watching a lot of the pirate movies. I think the one that <sighs> the one that I really like watching the series was actually um, the one Disney made. Was it Pirates of the Caribbean? Which I'm sure by now you know I'm titling most of these episodes after, right? Ho ho ho! Is it Mario? Now we just need to get rid of these enemies. Oh yeah, I shouldn't show off that new attack. Ah, uh, yeah, now I will just forget about it. Ah, oh, dang you, Merlin! I should have done the one in the back. I was going to, but then I said, well, let's get this over with. See, like, now Mario did 6 damage. Oh, said Mario. Everyone's like, yeah, yeah. Oh, wait, I already said that. <laughs> you know, it's kind of funny that for this specific chapter, the background really doesn't have much to it. So that's kind of weird. Oh, come on, Mario. Ah, finally, everyone, you saw it. Well, looks like Boo's tribute's gonna be coming up soon, so get ready for that. 
and if Mario didn't totally fail that, it would have been more awesome. But yeah, you all got to see Boo in action, and it happened when the number 66 was available. I need that star piece, everyone. If those things would get out of the way, I could get it, but no. It's kind of hard to dodge those. I always have a hard time. I don't know why, but I, every time I play as Mario on here, I can't get the attacks. But when I play as Goombella, I'm totally fine. See what I mean? Oh wow, well, this battle is over. Is it that stupid coin that's in the way? So this is the pirate's life, everybody. But anyways, that will have to do it for this week because I'm out of time. So join me next week when I actually cover more Pirates Grotto. So until next time, bye.